There is no maximum age limit fixed for e-hailing drivers under the Transport Ministry nor the Road Transport Department. In a statement on Facebook on Friday, Transport Minister Datuk Sri Dr. Wee Ka Siong said any individual may continue to hold or renew their vocational license as long as the individual complies with all other necessary conditions. This includes submitting a medical report confirming that they are healthy and able to perform driving functions safely. Dr. Wee was responding to the star report that Grab driver Rasamani Bativelu was left jobless after the 75-year-old was laid off by the e-hailing platform over the company's own internal restrictions on hiring drivers over the age of 69 due to safety reasons. Rasamani, nicknamed Grab Auntie, said she was disappointed that she could not continue as an e-hailing driver as she was physically fit. She also said she wanted to continue to be independent. Dr. Wee hoped all e-hailing service operators will take into consideration the issue of hardship faced by the public due to the COVID-19 pandemic and from time to time review the internal conditions they set for e-hailing drivers, including the maximum age limit. He also reminded e-hailing drivers to ensure that their health is in good condition at all times, so as to provide services that are safe for both passengers and other road users.